Hello students. In this tutorial, we are going to learn XML DTD. Right? DTD stands for Document Type Definition. It provides uh, the legal building blocks of an XML document. It is used to define document structure with a list of legal elements and their attributes. Okay, with the help of DTD, we can validate an XML document. That's it. Before validating an XML document, it should be well formed. Okay, that is the basic rules. So description of DTD here, here we have some uh, doc type element, this is the syntax, how we are creating an XML DTD, right? I will uh, quickly open that uh, folder here, where we are writing our programs. Here I am writing this program in C location, why? Because I am going to validate uh, this XML document with the help of PHP language. So that is the reason I'm writing this at server location. Okay, then I'm uh, taking this XML folder here. I am writing the programs. Okay, here I will take one new notepad. In this, I will write an XML. XML. Uh, then here I will take one note as a root uh, tag. Then here I will write to John. Here the XML is uh, nothing but purely. Yeah, it contains user defined tags, right? to from Ben. Then I will close this from reminder. Okay, what reminder it should be body. Before that body, we should give some heading, right? Heading means reminder. Reminder about what? And we need to write here. You can write your own uh, elements and your own tags here, right? Then I will close this. I will write the body part. Then what is the reminder for? We will plan for a for a meeting tomorrow at 10 a.m. So this is what what I want to send this information to Ben, right? Then I will close. Then I will close this uh, note root tag. Okay, so I will save this program with uh, note.xml note. Dot. I will save this with node.xml. Okay, I will try to choose as all types. Then I will save it. Again, I will go to location where it is saved. Let's see here. So I can choose it to open with if with any of the browser you can easily choose I will choose Internet Explorer right so this is my XML it is successfully executed now I want to validate this XML document so that I should use the XML that is DTD syntax right then here I will go to again that notepad here I will start writing the syntax before that I will use to write XML okay less than question mark XML version is equal to 1.0 so we will close this with a question mark only sorry it is 1.0 then I uh, will type doc type this is syntax not symbol with the not symbol here we have doc type document type it is so I will it should I should declare note root element okay then square bracket open then here I will write the elements what are the elements present followed with the uh, not symbol element e l e m e n t element what are the elements here again I need to declare note as a root tag then in between I need to write the elements to from comma heading comma body okay these are the elements so I will uh, close with greater than symbol then again, I will write element here with followed with the with not symbol element again. Then uh, two all the child elements I need to declare two here. I need to choose data type PC data PC parsable character data. Right, this is the data type. Then here, what I will again I will write not symbol element. What is our next uh, element here from then again i will write pc data okay 
then I will again write the type of not element heading H E D I N G heading again. I, sh I can copy and paste it, no problem. You can do that thing also. Here, PC data, right? Then again, I will write not. Element and last thing is the body. PC data. Okay, then uh, I should close this with greater than again. I should close it with the square bracket right, followed with greater than. Right. This is what the syntax for uh, DTD. So here I am writing the document type as note root node check for the spelling mistake if any so here i am declaring all the elements two from heading body two from heading body then i am writing individually all the things then i will save it save it then i will again go to browser just i will refresh it and close it otherwise right i will save it again i will go to the location where it is saved here in this time i will choose another browser here okay it's taking some time so this is how we write our ddd syntax see it is giving me some error here right line number three column number 15 so that I can easily go and check it. So what's the error? Line number three, note two. Yes, yeah, so I should give some space here. Right, because XML is a very strict language. Again, it is giving me my number four, column number 13. One, two, three, four, two. So for everything, I should give some spacing here. It is saying it's a good practice to go through with the errors as well. So see here, now it is saying it is perfect. So it is just showing me the uh, XML document only here. This part is not showing why because it is syntax, right? So how with the help of programming uh, language, I will uh, I will choose PHP here. Again, uh, to check this is an XML uh, DTD is a valid or not. Okay, this XML document is valid or not. Then I will choose some programming language here. So here I will take one more Notepad. Then I will write here PHP program. Okay, note uh, this is I will take. Then again I will write the PHP code less than question mark PHP. Sorry, it is in which small letters. Then I will write uh, this variable XML. XML is equal to here I am creating a DOM parser. New DOM document DOCOMENT. This is a syntax. So again I will take that variable XML. Then I will load that file. What was the name of the file? XML document file uh, that is uh, node.xml. But we have just covered that. Okay, so this is what this is the program. This is I have saved this program with node.xml. I'm loading this here. Okay, then I will check if condition if it is valid, then uh, I'm validating here with the help of x if condition xml. Okay. Then I will write validate function. Then just I will print echo. If that is the condition is true, then it will print it's a valid document. Then it will display me an error. Otherwise, echo or oh, it is not a valid document. Okay, then I will close it. So this is I will save this program with csc.php. Anything you can write, no problem. You can give all files, save it. Then again, I will start this AMP server here. Okay. Then again, I will go to browser from that program. So I will just start the Apache Tomcat server. 
then i will go to browser now here i will type localhost so what was our uh, name of the folder where we are writing this program is uh, xml so i should type that xml here XML in that we have csc.php see here it is giving me a valid document see with the help of php language we are checking this see if we miss something here okay here i am not writing in plus of two i am writing tom i will just to save it okay here i am not following the rules of dtd correctly here i am mentioning something and here describing something so it will i will just refresh it then it is showing me some error it is not a valid document so this is how we can validate an xml document with the help of uh, php you can language with the help of php language we can check okay and this is what so here we have uh, dtt of two types internal dtt and external dtt right this is the example for internal dtt in our next video we will try to cover external dtt as well okay thank you for watching